Good morning, everybody. Today we have a very special guest, Cora. She's going to help us with the video today. Um, so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be writing a set of instructions today. Um, very important that we use imperative verbs, which are bossy ones. Grab, spread, take, cut, slice. Um, and some... Some fronted adverbials need to be in there as well, such as, let me just move this, such as next, then, after that, and so on. Okay, so Cora's going to help us today. The instructions I want you to write are um, how to make a sandwich. Okay, and before anybody says, oh, I don't know how to make a sandwich, my mummy and daddy do everything for me. Cora is two and can make her own sandwich. So now's the time. Pardon? A oh, picture of daddy on the wall. Yeah, let's just insert the video for a picture of daddy. Wonderful. Um, so Cora's going to make her own ham sandwich, okay? Um, and then we're going to talk about the instructions to it. And there might be a little surprise, a little treat for um, you children at the end of the video. Okay, Cora, go on, here we go. Oh, let's go. Okay, so Cora's going on the chair. Cora, let's come on the chair. What do we need, Cora, to make ham sandwich? Butter. 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 Bread? Yeah. yeah. Bread. Anything else? Uh, bread. Okay. And anything else? Uh, uh, this, how about this? Cora? You missing something? She's just diving into the ham. Cora, we're missing something maybe. Uh, excuse me. Hello. And knife. knife. There you go. Okay. So, can you show me how to make ham sandwich, please, and show all the children how to make ham sandwich? Okay. I'm hoping she does it and doesn't just eat all the ham. We open things with our teeth here. Got some help opening it? Yeah. Okay, so what I'm looking for from your work today, everybody, is I want you to write a set of instructions on how to make a sandwich. It can be your favourite sandwich, it can just be a sandwich that you're having a lot um, in self-isolation. Um, number the instructions down the side and like I said make sure you use your front adverbials um, to tell me what order they're happening in obviously finally doesn't come first etc and get some bossy verbs in there as well <coughs> sneeze is uh, preferably not one at the moment are you doing your spreading? spread, there's a good verb spread ok she's been practicing doing her making her sandwiches for a long time now she's very very good at it you're just going to spread the butter on. She also likes to eat butter just on its own, so I mean, don't do that. It's not very healthy. It is when you when you finished. It is healthy when you finish. What eating butter? Okay. There's quite a lot of butter on there. I wouldn't advise to put that much butter on for you children either. Okay. So um. I promise, so that's what you're going to do, so Cora's going to have a sandwich, and um, whilst you're just finishing off making it, I'm just going to give you a little treat, um, a few people ask me to do things like this, so, uh, here we go, let's do it, are you ready? You ready? Thank you. In case you didn't know, for the adults and the grown-ups in the room, that was TikTok. Recently discovered it. Popular dance, apparently. Not sure why. There she is eating butter. You're not. You're not supposed to eat butter. This one is a little one. It's just a little one. Okay, brilliant. So that's just a little one. So that little ones are fine. Okay, everybody. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video, keep watching, um, keep doing the work is the most important thing, send your work in on Twitter, comment on YouTube, keep working hard uh, and say big thank you to your adults and your parents because they're doing a great job of being teachers, maybe they can take my job uh, when we're all out of isolation. Okay everybody, be safe, wash your hands, don't eat loads of butter, eat healthily. Bye everyone, see you tomorrow.